African-American actors and politician. Her career included oh, success again? on Broadway and a touring opera singer and in Hollywood films. Her portrayal as the villain of the villain in the 1935 movie, She Inspired Disney's Evil Queen, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. And she was born on November 21st, 1900 in Bhutan, New Jersey. She died June 28th, 1980 in New York, New York. She was a member of the Democratic Party. She was married to Melvin Douglas from 1931 to 1980. Uh, her daughter was Peter Gallagher Douglas. Mary Helen Douglas, her book was Helen Gallagher Douglas Project of Full Life. Now her star is located at 1708 Vine Street in the category of motion pictures. She was in the 1940s, she entered Helen Gallagher. politics. She was elected to the United States House of Representatives for California's yep. 14th Congressional District as a Liberal Democrat in 1944. And she served three full terms. During this time, she carried yep. on an affair with Congressman Lyndon B. Johnson. Helen Gallagher. Mrs. Douglas was mentioned in the song George Burby by satirist yep. Tom. Blur, the song begins, Hollywood often tried to make show business with politics, from Helen Gallagher to Robert yeah. Reagan. Now, by the, in the 1940, Gallagher Douglas, oh no, in 1950, Gallagher Douglas ran for the United States Senate, even though the incumbent Democrat Sheldon H. Doughty was seeking a third term. William Malone, the Democrat of the state chairman in California, had advised Douglas to wait until 1952 to run for the Senate rather than split the party in a fight with Downey Gallagher. Douglas, however, told Malone that Downey had neglected veterans and small growers and must be unseated. Downey withdrew from the race and the primary candidate Payne was supported in third candidate, Manchester Brody. The owner of the publisher of the Los Angeles Daily News, when Gulligan Douglas defeated Body for the nomination, Dowdy Dowdy endorsed the Republican U.S. Senate U.S. Representative Richard M. Nixon.